It's the Barrett Bunch. Judge Amy Coney Barrett's large family took center stage at her confirmation hearings today. Six of her seven impeccably behaved children filed okay. into the hearing room along with her husband. The family did great. Y'all clean up well. You look good. And the kids won the heart of California Senator Dianne Feinstein, one of the judge's fiercest critics. I was wondering if you might introduce us to them. Sure. So I have my husband, Jesse, my son, JP, my daughter, Emma, my daughter, Juliet, my daughter, Tess, my daughter, Vivian, and my son, Liam. And then behind them are my um, six siblings who are with me today. My sister, Vivian, my sister, Eileen, my brother, Michael, my sister Megan, and my sister Amanda, and my sister Carrie. Judge Barrett's brood includes two adopted from Haiti and an eight-year-old child with Down syndrome who was not present. You don't have a magic formula for how you do it and handle all the children and your job and your work. It's improv. <laughs> yes, yes. The 48-year-old jurist was asked about George Floyd's death at the hand of cops. My 17-year-old daughter Vivian, who's adopted from Haiti, um, all of this was erupting. It was very difficult for her. Um, we wept together in my room. My children, to this point in their lives, have had the benefit of growing up in a cocoon where they have not yet experienced hatred or violence. Judge Barrett was bombarded with complex legal that, questions, but, but the whip-smart jurist answered them too. without notes. Most of us have multiple notebooks and notes and books and things like that in front of us. Can you hold up what you've been referring to and answering our questions? <laughs> Is there anything on it? Uh, that letterhead that says United States Senate. That's impressive. She returned to mommy mode when she told the senators she wouldn't let her personal opinions impact her Supreme Court decisions. Nobody wants to live in accord with the law of Amy. I'm sure my children don't even want to do that.